Today's video is monthly grocery haul. We do our grocery shopping once a month from Walmart and Sam's Club. I am going to show you a little bit in the store while me and my husband are grocery shopping. And then when we get home, I'll show you everything that we got. Also, I'm going to be putting everything away. So if you like this kind of video, stay tuned and let's get this video started. This patio sectional looks so so cute. Oh nice. Fire pit. That included with that price. Two grand. Huh. 736 no with fire pit. It's quite big. There's a basket on the bottom. And then there's this bench and then that one. There's a the basket. The rug match too. That's actually pretty cool. Yeah. I think the rug. Two, three. Uh, I don't know. I think I like this more. I like a sectional. Prices of mushrooms here are so good. And they're like large and a lot of it too. I think I want to get this one. It's very cold in here. He just bought strawberries from um, Smith's yesterday, so I don't think I'm going to need it. I have a lot of salad mix over there, like lettuce and other um, stuff mixed with it. We need to get some steak. These are really good price here at Sam's. It's a good deal because at Walmart you can you get like two or three slices for like over twenty dollars. So this is good because it's a lot of them, and these last us for like a couple days, like three days at least. So that's good deal over here. Okay, so I don't know if um, I've seen this before, but I don't remember planks in a blanket that looks good actually I mean I could just make that I I know how to make that I made that before in Christmas and then this one looks so good chicken breast fries it's hot so I don't know if it's hot spicy or what because if it's hot spicy then my husband and my son will probably not eat that they don't like spicy but I will <laughs> I've never seen that before. Hmm? This is like stromboli, babe. They have a lot of yogurts here. This one is what I got from uh, Walmart last time. I didn't even know some scary that. This uh, flavor is so good. So I got one of that. And then this Chobani. I like the Chobani Greek yogurt, but I don't like all those other flavors. I only like the strawberry banana. So I never get those. If they would have just like strawberry banana, I might. But yeah, I don't eat the other flavors. Have you guys seen this before? It's the Takis Waves. <laughs> I saw this um, a couple of weeks ago, but I keep forgetting to show it to you guys. It's Takis Waves. I like Takis, so I don't know if this is any good. That looks good. If you've tried this, let me know. Is it the same as the regular Takis or not? I don't know, it's weird. <laughs> Have you guys seen this before? It's smart food. It says limited time flavor. It's uh, Doritos, but it's popcorn Doritos. Wow, I've never seen that before. It's so weird. I like Doritos, but I don't know if I want to eat popcorn. And like I said before, I uh, got the big um, Doritos here before, and it's not as cheesy as the regular size. So that is weird. 
It looks good, but popcorn Doritos. <laughs> Let me know if you have tried it before. Limited time, so if you want to try it, get it. How much is that? I think it's five dollars. I do get my minced garlic here. It lasts me a while. And the expiration date is really good. This is only, look at that, $4 for all that. It lasts me a couple months. I think um, the last one, it lasts me like three months. And the expiration date is even longer than that. Okay, this baking soda has been out of stock for a while. I was excited when I saw it because I use this on everything. And every time we shop, we use... What's that called again? I forgot. <laughs> Inst Instacart? Scan, scan and go? Yeah, scan and go. There you go. Instacart. <laughs> Insta I don't know. I forgot. Instacart, the delivery service. See, if you use your scan and go, this is your fast lane. You don't have to go to the line. They usually don't have line here anyway, but still, you don't have to move everything that you have. It's so windy today. So we are now going to Walmart. Like I told you guys, the Sam's is right next to Walmart. That's why we always go here. Yeah, so we Always check for expiration of this Chobani yogurt. Sometimes Walmart sells them even though it's expired. I um, got that before and so now I always check it. So is your store or your Walmart empty? Because ours is pretty full. I don't know. I keep getting comments that their Walmart is empty, but ours is full. See? There's like some hole there, but it's pretty full for the most part. I don't know why I keep getting comments that there's food shortage and I shouldn't buy a lot of food, but yeah, ours is pretty full. We don't have any issues with that here in Las Vegas. This is Walmart. I haven't been in the mood for fries. We still have a lot in the freezer, but I wanted to try this so bad because I love the Arby's curly fries. I don't know if it's gonna turn out the same if I cook it at home, but I pick up one. Now, have you tried this one? Because this one looks so good too, but I want to try that one first. See if it's any good. If you have tried this one, let me know in the comments down below. If you are new here to my channel, hello and welcome. I am so happy you're here. My name is Cell. I am a wife and a full-time working mommy of one sweet boy. If you like and enjoy contents about realistic cleaning motivation, satisfying home organization, grocery hauls, and mom life, I upload those kind of videos every Friday. So be sure to subscribe and turn your notification bell on so you wouldn't miss any more of my future uploads. Alright guys, so this is everything that we got from Sam's Club and Walmart. We're gonna start with the beverage. We have the Sunny D um, 24 pack orange juice here. This is from Sam's. We got the Mocha um, Starbucks Frappuccino. That's from Sam's. Then we got a couple cases of the Pepsi here. And then up here, we have three gallons of this lactate milk. We use a lot of this and they tend to be out of stock a lot. So we always grab at least three bottles. We have this whipped cream here, and then on the back we have this fair life um, whole milk. I give this to my son because he has a lot of um, protein more than this one. I have a Chobani yogurt here. This is the strawberry banana flavor. My son eats that too. We have Yakult here. 
if you don't know what Yakult is, it's a pro probiotic drink. We have some of these. Last time I got this from Sam's. Um, it's like a pack of four. But they don't have it right now. So we just pick up this from uh, Walmart. And then we have Laughing Cow's Cheese here. I don't know, but in my opinion, this is kind of like cream cheese. But I don't, this doesn't give me stomach ache because I have a uh, lactose intolerance, but this one don't give me stomach ache at all. And I love um, using this with um, banana cinnamon uh, bread and then just like egg on top, it's so good. And then we have Greek uh, yogurt here. This is the honey vanilla. I got this last time from Walmart, but I, then I saw it at Sam's and it's like bigger and it's so good. I bring this to work, put it in a little um, uh, food container glass and then I put um, granola cereal on top of it. So good. And then here we have mozzarella cheese. This is the double pack. This is price of one at Sam's. So if you have Sam's Club, grab it there. It's cheaper. We have seasoned curly fries here. This is like the Arby's style. I hope it comes out the same because I like the Arby's um, curly fries. And then here we have this minced garlic. This is like super cheap at Sam's Club. I think it's it's like four dollars. It's three dollars something. So I get this from there. This lasts me like a long time, like three to four months. And then we have these hot dog buns here. I was thinking of cooking one of the sausage we got today for dinner. So we pick up this one. This is what I get all the time. I like that it's like brown browner or like more toasted. I don't know what the, I don't know really what I'm saying, but I like this one. And we only get this when we need them because they do go bad. And then we have the cinnamon raisin bread here. My son really likes this for breakfast. I do too. Um, we have sliced bread here. This is just the regular white bread. And then we have this patisserie chicken here from Sam's Club. I don't know. It just looks so good. I was thinking of making um, pancit and use this for um, ingredients. So... That's why I picked this up. I'll probably take out all the skin and eat it. I like the skin. And then we have this uh, beef brisket. Here, this is um, fully cooked. You just need to heat it up or warm it up in the oven. It's super quick and easy, but it's good. You can have this or eat this with um, bread, like a sandwich, or I usually eat this with rice. We have... Um, style steak here grab a couple of them because we are all out of it we have these um oscar mayer bacon here this is the smoke uh, bacon last couple months sam's club is out of this so i made sure i grab it when i saw it there's three in one um package and it's a lot cheaper to grab this at sam's than walmart and then we have pg apple here grab this at sam's we have mushroom here these are the bottom white mushroom grab that from sam's as well we have ground pork here this is from walmart we grab two of them we have brown sugar and honey breakfast sausage here these are so good this is the only flavor i like so we grab this my son likes this too and my husband so he got that one and then we have this better cheddar here. This is the sausage I was telling you guys about that we'll probably have for dinner tonight. This is so good. I don't know. I didn't like it at first, but then I tried it again and I did really like it. It has cheese inside it and it's so good. So we grab two of that. And then I grab these little smokies here. Um, you said this is sausage, right? Sausage with the cheese inside it. I saw that uh, Frank's in a blanket at Sam's and I was thinking of making my own because it's easy to make it. So I just grabbed this one and hopefully it's good just like this one. And then I grabbed these beef sticks from Walmart. I wanted to have my son try this, see if he likes it for like lunch at school. I don't know. I've never tried this before too. So we'll see because he always eat like pepperoni and ham. 
and turkey so i want him to try something different and yeah that's why i grabbed that and it's a little pack so that if you don't like it i'm sure my husband would eat that and then we have these honey ham slices here like i said my son uh, likes this usually i make him lunchables for school i use this and then some cheese i take this to work too like sandwich with just this and mayo some uh lettuce every once in a while so there's that and then we have this chicken here this is chicken breast and these are like the trimmed and already um sliced small so i pick up two of that and then i pick up more of the z bar because i had um my son tried this before i pick up the five pieces one and they are, he actually like it he um took it to school so i pick up the um variety pack and this is the 20 bars so he could have he could try this one too hopefully he'll like it too because he does like the chocolate chip one and then we have nutty buddy uh bar here my husband um eats that we have these moths animals here for snack and then i pick up this rapid rice instant yeast i was thinking of baking uh some uh cupcake and also was thinking of making my own pizza dough so i saw a recipe in youtube and i want to try this one and then go back here we have a lot of soup here um we are low in soup so these are something that lasts for a long time the shelf life of this or the expiration date is really long so you can buy a lot of this and just keep it in your pantry and you know you'll never really run out of food so we have this creamy chicken noodle here this is a favorite in the house i really like this one so we pick up um a lot of that i think there's like 12 of that and then we have this baked potato steak and cheese here my husband said he wants to try this because he's never tried it before i haven't either so we pick up some of that too i think there's like four or five of that and then we have some mushroom pieces here we use this a lot i use this to saute with other vegetable and we especially use this for like beef um burger patties with gravy and we put this and it's so good it's like a beef steak so that's so good that's why we grab more of that and then we have corned beef hash here we pick up two of them we still have a couple in the pantry but it's always good to stock up and then we have more gravy here we use a lot of gravy i like when um i eat something with gravy i like a lot of gravy so we pick up four gravy here this has these items has long shelf life so even if it's a lot it's not gonna go bad fast so it's good to have them on hands in the pantry and then we have these lunchables here sometimes my son wants to like take this at school i often make him one but sometimes he wants to bring one of this so i just pick up one this is from uh sam's club it's like five dollars for six of them and when you get them individually at walmart it's like two dollars so it's easy to um it's cheaper to get it at sam's club and then go back over there we have a lot of frozen items and this is something new that I saw at Sam's Club. I showed it to you earlier. I wanted to try it. Hopefully, it's not too much breading. And yeah, hopefully, it's good. If you have tried this before, let me know in the comments down below what you think. Is it too spicy? Once I've tried this before I post this video, I'll let you know as well. We have this chicken parmesan here. My husband said it was good so he picked up another one um we have fried rice here these are good and easy i take this to work and just put it in the microwave for like three minutes and you're good we have breakfast sausage here this is the sausage egg and cheese And then usually we get the Angus uh, burger, but this time we want to try different ones. So we got this um, Bradshaw Ranch Tick Juicy Beef Patties. So we pick up two of them because there's only 12 in one. So 
yep i'll let you know once um we've tried this how it is because we haven't like i said this is something new that we got this is not our usual burger but we want to try this one and then this is another orange chicken i told you before from my other grocery haul my husband really liked this so and then we have meat lovers breakfast bowl here this is a staple here in the house we have sneaker bars here we take this to work just for like a uh, sugar rush because sometimes i get so hungry at work and my sugar gets low and this is something i just take and then here we have um oreo individual pack um cookies here we have some danish different flavors here we have apple cinnamon they have berries and cream cheese there's cream cheese inside my husband will i mean my son will probably like the cream cheese one and then there's blueberry and cream cheese there's chewy bars here there's also different flavors here there's chocolate chip peanut butter chocolate chip and s'mores then we have cup noodles here and then back here we have these slim jim crackers right here we have these nutri grain um snack bar we have there's um three different flavor as well there's strawberry blueberry and apple cinnamon there's Vienna sausage here and canned tuna down here. This is something you can stack in your pantry too. So always good to have that on hand. My husband has been eating a lot of tuna salad, so I pick up more of that. We have this um, all-purpose flour here. Um, there's Cinnabon right here. This is French toast Cinnabon. My son, my son would eat this for breakfast every once in a while. And then we have diced peaches here because we are out of um, the fruit cups. And then we have the Salisbury steak here. My husband always pick up one or two every time we go grocery shopping. And then we have this Wilson cheese here. My son likes this one. Moving on at the front again, we have this jasmine rice here. This is the big bag. Last time, uh, Sam's Club and Walmart is completely out of rice. So I pick up another bag because we, well, I eat and my son eats rice a lot. So it's good to have this. This probably never expire if it does like for a long time. So there's that. We have eggs here uh this is the 60 pieces one we got this from walmart somebody asked me if we ever get through our eggs if we ever finish it yes we do we eat a lot of eggs here um we don't just like eat it for breakfast we cook this i cook this for like hard-boiled eggs or i make egg salad and take it to work like sandwich so we do eat and use a lot of eggs here so this never goes bad and then we have some chips here i have a couple bags of dorito and these tortilla chips and for non-food item oh actually i forgot this one we have these um hot and spicy um cup noodles here i like to take this to work together with a sandwich and then lucky charm cereal here and some is finally back in stock with this um baking soda this is what i was telling you guys about last time i got the little one from walmart and so when i saw this at sam's club i picked this up because this is really good um deal for 15 pounds it's like eight dollars and i use this a lot i use it for cooking for laundry for um cleaning especially like for the rugs like when i'm vacuuming the rugs i like to put this for like deodorizer and then we have this Swiffer um, duster here. I am out of this, so I pick up more. And then we have this stainless steel um, cleaner here. I pick up this Neutrogena makeup remover because I didn't realize I am all out of it until I needed it. And then I pick up this Hydroboost gel cream. This is what I use for moisturizer and then we got more of these triple a batteries because we are completely out and 
we use batteries for anything really and then for the last thing we got these bounce dryer sheets here it says pet hair and lint guard i think it helps a little bit not completely but it helps a little bit and that is pretty much what we got and now i'm just gonna put everything away and I'll show that to you guys as well. So I actually decided to separate this video into two because it was way too long. And when I was looking at my analytics, I noticed that some of you guys only wants to see what I got from the grocery haul. And some of you guys only wants to see how I restock everything and put them away. So I decided to just split this video. So if you are not subscribed yet, make sure you subscribe, turn your notification bell on because the next video is going to be fridge and pantry, restock, putting grocery away. Here's a little clip of it it's coming out really soon after this video